What's going on you guys? This is a Max KDI here with another Dell Optiplex 790. This is a small phone factor and today I'm going to be replacing the power supply and show you guys how to do that. So there's a latch right here. Remove the side cover panel. And right here is the power supply right there. I'm going to be replacing uh, with the same, same model power supply right here. So if your power supply fails, I'm going to show you guys how to replace the power supply. You can just go online and get the same power supply. And uh, first thing you guys will have to do is make sure you get the latex gloves. And uh, you get a Phillips screwdriver. And what you're going to do is remove to the side like this. And we're going to go ahead and remove the screws here. There will be three screws in the back here. One, two, three, and what you guys are going to do is uh, you're going to switch it to the other side like this so you guys can see better. And you're going to remove the right here, disconnect the stadium power from the optical drive. And you're going to disconnect the little clip right here. You're going to take your finger and press to the left to release the secure lock for the hard drive cage. And you're going to disconnect the SATA and power cable from the hard drive. And what you do is lift up like this and it comes right out like that. So remove the hard drive cage. And what we have to do is uh, we're going to disconnect the four pin right here for the power. Or there's a little pin right here. So with your finger, you're going to press on the clip right here, secure clip right here, so to release it, stick your finger and just go like this uh, and you release the secure clip. And you're going to go ahead and take off the wall four pin right here from the power supply. A little plastic you have to take off too right here. So we're going to lift this up like this, remove the wires. And the power supply is right here. What you have to do is a little clip right here. There's a secure clip right here. And for the 24 pin, we're going to take your finger and right in the middle. You see right there? So, what you're going to do is uh, you press on the to release the secure clip for the power supply. Just like that, and it comes right out. He's in the mid, it's right in the middle. You have to press on to release the secure clip right the lock. See right there? And so what you have to do is you take a screwdriver right here. And you have to press with the screwdriver, press it down to release the secure clip right there. You see that? So you take this like this. And you press on it to release the secure clip right there for the power supply. And the power supply comes right out. So so what you're going to do is just power supply, you can remove the power supply and the PCI bracket clip right here to get that removed and power supply comes right out really easy, really quick and we're going to install a newer one, I'm just going to zoom in the camera okay so we got that one removed And here's the newer one that I'm installing, exact same one. It's really easy to install. So we install the power supply and now you're going to connect the 24 pin. And we're going to connect the 4 pin. You guys probably can't see, I have to zoom out the camera. Okay, so lay this down. 
connected the four pin. And you have to clip it in right, you see the little clips right here, the metal clips that holds out the wire. Just like that. So we installed the power supply and now we're gonna reconnect the we'll go in the back and reinstall the back the screws here for the power supply. Okay, so one, so two more screws in the back of the power supply. And three. So we install those three screws. Now we're gonna flip the flip the computer like this, and we're gonna install back to our hard drive cage. So you install it back. You just take this like that. Connect the SATA and power. Really easy. And what you're gonna do is when you install back the hard drive cage, there's a little clip right here, you press your finger again to lock it. And you press it to the right to lock the clip right here, the secure clip, the hard drive cage. This means left and unlocked, right means locked. Okay, and now we're gonna install back the little plastic right here. This is for the wire. And this holds the power supply right here. So the way you install is just like this. So we're gonna go ahead and take off the hard drive cage again. Remove that, install this first. And we're gonna install back the hard drive cage back. You're gonna connect back to SATA and power. And you're gonna take this little secure clip and you're gonna press it to the right with your finger to secure the clip right here. Unlocked, it means locked. And install back the hard uh, optical drive. You're gonna connect back to SATA and power cable. And we're done. And what you guys have to do is just put the side cover panel back on. So you guys, this is for the Dell Optiplex 790 small phone factor, how to change the power supply. Thanks for watching, bye.